first create react app for this i'll give a command as npx create react app instagram then react creates an application for me with the name instagram so it takes some time to install the app so once if it is done i can see instagram folder is created inside my instagram parent folder so as you can see my instagram app exists now so now i'll go to my instagram directory and i will start my server with the command npm start then my server is started as you can see here i can see the logo of the react so now I'll, as you can see inside the src there is a file called app.js so here because of this header code our uh, icon appears now i'll remove that and i'll give a h1 tag with uh, description as hello welcome to instagram and i'll save this and you can see in the front end so hello welcome to instagram is appeared now it's time to install tailwind css so to install tailwind css i'll go to the browser and give a search command as install tailwind css in react so as you can see these are the steps which we are going to follow to install tailwind css in our react application as you can see uh, this is my install command and the next one is initialization command so let me go ahead and give the install command so i'll give the command as i have copied the command and i'll paste the command here as you can see the tailwind css is installed now i have to initialize the tailwind css so i'll copy this command and i'll paste here and then my tailwind css is initialized now i'll open tailwind config file and as in the documentation uh, we can see here the content of the file has to be modified so i'll copy it here from here and then i'll paste it here and then i'll save the file so as you can see we are asking our react application to filter uh, jsx and ts files now i'll remove everything in index.css and give command and i'll try to import all the tailwind css libraries here so i have imported base and then i have to import components and then i have to import utilities so i have imported all and uh, here i give a uh, tailwind css class so i wanted my text to be red so i have given and let me test my browser so here as you can see our uh, tailwind css is uh, not implemented so for that i will restart my server once and as you can see my tailwind css is installed successfully and it is implemented now i have to install the formic library this formic library is used to uh, implement forms in react so it's a library so i'll go to browser and i'll give a search command as install formic in react so i'll open this link and as you can see uh, these are the steps to install formic in our react application so i'll copy this command and i'll go to my vs code editor 
and I'll open my terminal and I'll give this command inside my Instagram directory. So it installs formic library for me. Now I have to install routing libraries. Now I'll give command as npm install react-router-dom. So now the routing libraries are installed in my application. And I'll restart my server once to make sure that the changes are affected. 